Hey girl, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl, Alessandra motherfucking Lux girl. Um, and today I'm gonna be applying at the strip club. But today we're gonna be auditioning. Well, not auditioning, because they said we didn't have to audition, honey. They said we solid. Um, we're just going for an interview. So I'm about to do my makeup. So far, this is what my face looks like, just straight out of the pool. I have to do my hair as well and an outfit um and i'll take you with me on what it's like and you're probably like oh my god girl why are you doing this job like you know people already have very much negative things to say all the time but honestly this job is liberating this job allows me to do my schoolwork while i'm you know at the clock and i also have another job interview on wednesday and you're probably like oh girl why are you getting these jobs if you do social media the question that that's the question i'm trying to ask myself too girl um i don't know i don't have an answer for you for that yet so um yeah my sister's here with her dogs so let me do my makeup and then i'll be back i i don't know where this video gonna go but it's gonna go somewhere girl i don't i don't know also today my um, car window got broken into so I'm about to do my makeup real quick. We didn't record when I um first before I was supposed to leave, girl, because I was already running late. But this is my makeup. It's what it came out. Honestly, it looked a little bit better. And this is the outfit that I wore. This, and then I put my cowgirl boots on because you know. Hold on, let me see if I can show you. Ooh, I need to bleach my asshole today. But I put my cowgirl boots on because you know I thought I was giving you know. Did white girl? Cause that's what they like, honestly. And I got the i'm so happy i'm so excited i almost look like a bad bitch i do i really do give bad bitch let me sit down for a second so we can talk but i really do give bad bitch let me fix this girl get my ankle straight but yes look at me huh can you imagine me anywho i'm so happy i'm so excited i know you're probably like oh my god girl this job you're so excited about sure i am because i know i'm gonna be good at it okay <laughs> look at me Look at her. Freaking little bad bitch. What's up? Run me my money. <laughs> okay. Anyways, um, I love you. And actually, you know what? Since this vlog was like short, I'm just gonna continue it to when I do my first day. Um, I'll show you when I go get my license. I'm gonna do that this week after I fix my car window because that's top priority. And why am I talking like that? I promise I don't do drugs. I just anxiety um i'm so pretty uh, anywho um yeah i'll just see you in a little bit hey y'all sorry i didn't record um you know in the club girl i was having anxiety i was about to throw up um but anyways we got some money we got some money honey we got some money honey and we'll be back tomorrow okay um tomorrow i will actually look at footage and shit like that i will insert some pictures of what i look like but yeah, honey, we got some money off of one man and um, a stage stand. That's it! Now, peace. Hey, besties, I'm here today. Um, it's uh, I think it's like around 2 o'clock right now. Um, I'm going to get dressed and I'm going to get on the floor. There's only one customer that I see so far, but we know we're going to bring the money in. We're going to be with the positive vibes and we're going to get more customers. I actually do get some new things today. I'm going to show you that right now. I'm going to go pee and then we'll get dressed together and shit like that. I'm just going to make up. Cute. I think I'm gonna keep the glasses on tonight, today, depending on the outfit. So let me go use the bathroom and then I'll be back. All right. So this is what I bought today. I just got another thong and this little skirt. Um, we're gonna try it on, see if it looks cute. I think I'm probably gonna wear a dress today, but we're gonna see. This is a skirt. I don't really like it. I don't like the way it looks on my body. But I think I'm gonna try on the dress instead. So I'm gonna tell you about my first night and how it went. Honestly, I think it went pretty good. Um, I met this one guy. Um, and all we did was really talk. It was kind of dead in here, but you know, it's all right. Um, I am really nervous. Like I'm here now and I'm really nervous. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I am pretty nervous, but I'm pretty excited. Because, like, it is a little bit like an adrenaline rush when you do get the money. I'm not going to lie to you. Like, it is an adrenaline rush. I'm like, dang, all I had to do was talk or shake a little booty and I got some money. So, it is, like, pretty um addicting. This is what I'm wearing, though, today. 
this little dress to start off because you know it's the daytime so i want to keep it a little classy and then we'll turn into a little pour at night but yeah it 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 was a little just nerve-wracking to get on the pole but today hopefully i get to practice on it a little bit while we're dead and um I'm not confident that I could do any pole tricks or anything like that, but I think like, just like to spin to see like, you know, what it do, what it do. I just want to see that. Um, I don't know, I kind of had fun. I know that sounds a little weird, but it was kind of fun. I think it's just the adrenaline rush from the money. Like when you get the money, you're just like, woo, like, like that's all it took. <laughs> So I do think like I could see like how it becomes extremely addicting like super fast. Um, but I just need to straighten up those little front pieces real quick. But I feel like you know it's definitely worth it. Ugh. So yeah, um, I'm not gonna lie to it. The like getting um, undressed. The first time was so intimidating. I'm not gonna lie, like it was intimidating. I'm not gonna lie. I put all my bottoms in the bathroom. Um, I don't know, y'all. A bitch just be having anxiety, but everybody's been really nice here and things like that. Um, I guess we're like in what they say like a slow season, but we'll make it fast season because we need to do what it do. So, I'm just lotioning up. One thing I really don't like is the fact that we can't wear glitter. I would definitely like to wear glitter. You know, I'm a glitter girl. So, that's kind of annoying. But I understand, you know, why. But whatever. Um, these are the two perfumes that I use. I think they smell really good. This one definitely smells very girly. I spray it out at the end because I have my shoes on and everything like that. Um, let me take these glasses off real quick, honey. And, um, I think we're just going to fix my lip liner, and then I think I'm going to be ready to go on the floor. If I forgot my lip liner again, I will literally freak the fuck out. Oh my god. Oh no, I didn't. It's right here. <laughs> I thought I had forgot it. I need to grab a piece of paper, though, because uh, I'm a little sweaty. I wonder if Sabrina Carpenter knows that they play her songs at the strip club. Um, no. I look like I fucking passed out, like I'm dead. Hey girl, today I'm about to get, I'm, well, I'm getting ready right now to go drop off my new license at this new club I'm working at. Let me look at my camera, hold on. She had dirty spot. <laughs> but today I'm going to go drop off my license at this new club. I actually got hired at two other clubs. I did my nails. Um, mm -hmm. I think we're going to change our name at this club and we're going to go with like Chloe or something like that. Just because I feel like anthrax is scaring them off a little bit because they're like anthrax, like a bitch anthrax deadly but we're still gonna keep anthrax for 
the naughty the whipping and we're also gonna go to the so yeah i'm almost done getting ready i just need to do like a little you know a little blush i mean not blush a little highlighter think we are pretty much good let's see what my hair is giving i think this lip might be a little bit too dark um for my liking so let's try to put some of this on there mm -hmm. i think that's all right all right let's see what my hair is giving i was like do i have like dirt or something but it's not all right i'm gonna just recrimp some pieces but since it's just to drop off a license and you know like see face um i don't really have to do the most so yeah i'm gonna take you with me to the store so you can see everything i buy i'm actually excited for this weekend because i do have someone that i know that's going to come to the club so we know we're gonna get so we gotta get some cute stuff for that because it's her birthday, so we wanna wanna milk the cow, okay? Um makeup looks good, right? It looks bomb. It looks huh? Who? You're talking to huh? Me? Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I think I'm gonna do bottom mascara. I look so fucking good. Honestly, this is so sinister. But okay, I'm gonna recrimp this up and then I'm gonna see when we're on the way and when I have my outfit on and everything like that. I just look so good. Like, huh? Do you wanna pay me? Where are your funds? How much are you spending? A thousand? Two thousand? Oh, ten thousand? <laughs> pay the oh, cash at me, Zell. <laughs> okay, um, let me do that and I'll see you in a little bit. I'm waiting for my thing to um, heat up. I'm going to give you a little haul of everything that I bought at the beauty supply store today. So I got this one because our house mom at the other club, she usually has these or whatever. And I don't know about putting my lip on them. I usually just put it on my finger. But I just got my own to carry in my bag. And then I always get my favorite two lip liners. These are it. These are the ones that I actually have for my lip combo today. They're the Ruby Kisses. They're in the color brown and nude brown. And then I also got... Where is it? Hold on. Also got these little earrings. I originally was going to look at my dermal fix today, but they were closed for the 4th of July. So I'm going to do that tomorrow. But I just got these little cute ones. Like simple, just cute. Um, Because I usually have these teardrop earrings that you saw at the beginning that I usually wear. And that's like my whorish um, earrings. I don't know how well they're going to do at this club. I feel like for every single club you have to have a different aesthetic so you yeah, know like i know the white men love that i don't know if the other men are gonna love that you know what i mean so yeah these were only like 5.99 6.99 so yeah your beauty supply store girl and also um i just want to say something like i don't give a fuck if you like say nasty things about me or for whatever the fuck like you know like people are like oh, are you gonna are you scared like people are like judging you like when i post it on my story girl i don't give a fuck I don't give two fucking rats ass because at the end of the day, we're all working for somebody. I'm just doing it for me. And you might be like, oh, well, um, blah, 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 blah. I don't do anything. I don't, you might be like, blah, 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 blah. I don't do anything. I don't do anything like nothing sexual. I don't do nothing, bitch. Like, I don't do nothing. I'm just a pretty ass bitch getting paid for my time. I twerk. Y'all bitches go to the club and twerk for free, so. what they do okay so let me do this and i'll be right back for real this time this is what i'm wearing to go drop off my um license yeah so um i'm out this bitch <laughs>
I'll never be back at the Urban Club. Never again. Never again. Never again. Never again. Never. I don't give a fuck. Never again. Never again. Let me drink this and then I'm going to tell you, bitch. I'm so dumb. Let me tell you, yesterday the plan was this guy that I know, this manager that I know from when I was like, look at all, I'm tired. This guy I know, he's my manager. He, we used to be friends. We, we, I thought he was like this, but we not like this. So he told me he was coming from Tampa last night. That's why I literally only went to this club specifically. Because if not, I was going to wait till monday till my license came in for the other club um most ratchet club i've ever been to i i i will not be coming back dj horrible the dj i'll tell you the story because me and the dj got into a little tiff but this man never showed up he ignored me like i texted him and he ignored me like i was like oh okay so i'm ready to him but it's cool i <laughs> already knew that I was not going to make money at this club because, bitch, I ain't got no BBL. I, I don't be shaking it like that. Um, For the girl's sexy. And that's not what it gave, okay? It's not what it gave. But that's just not what it gave. Like, there was not, there was not feeling me. There was not feeling. There was not feeling. There was not feeling. They just wanted. And I don't have all that. And also... I don't know how I got into this, but I was orchestrating bitches um, to sell their pussies. I was just not going to go there, and the girl was only selling it for $200. Full, full service, $200. I'm never going back. I'm never going back. And as soon as, like, a client came in, they were literally already, like, on top of him. The people were literally there for the sections. They hadn't even ordered their bottle yet, and the girls were already there. I'm like, bitch, they haven't even picked you yet. It was just very much never going back. Never going back. Girl, let me show you this, girl. Girl, let me show you this, girl, girl. Mind you, I paid 60 to work. <laughs> I was gonna leave with zero. I was gonna leave with zero, but then I lucked out. I didn't even luck out, girl. I don't even know what you would call it. But this is the reality. <laughs> this is the reality. And that's fine. This is half of whatever the fuck. It's just not for me. It's just it's just not for me. So 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. This is from a dance. This 25 is from a dance. And then these $5 are from a stage set. The man that gave me these $25, I gave him a dance. And he didn't want to do more because he just wanted full service. Because he said that... In his country, they do full service. And I was like, well, I don't know who you're going to ask for full service. But I told him that the girls were going to charge him like $1,000. He, he he didn't speak Spanish. So I was basically the interpret, interpreter. And I told him, he told me to get that this girl, right? I brought her over. I was like, he wanted to dance from her or whatever the fuck. And I was like, oh, like he wants to dance from you just to see if she would do the full service or whatever. And I asked her, I was like, do you do that? And she was like, yeah. And I was like, okay, how much? She said, $200. I was trying so hard not to judge. I literally was trying so hard not to judge. I, that was my cat opening my door. I literally was like, okay, so I told him 250 And on top of that, bitch, I looked at her and I said, off of that 250 bitch, you're giving me something. I don't give a fuck if, I, I'm not your pimp ho, but... <laughs> I facilitated the arrangement. And tell me how I didn't see the bitch all night. My fault. I should have told her right then and there. But I was really just ready to get the fuck ASAP. Because no. And then I told the DJ. I was like, I only made $6. Because I'm I'm sorry, but there's nothing for me to tip out here. There's nothing for me to tip out here. And I was like, oh, I made $6. And he was like, and I was like, do you want me to give you my $6? 
And he was like, yeah. And I was like, no. <laughs> I was like, I have nothing for you. Like, some of the people there are so rude. Like, so rude, so entitled, so nasty, so ratchet. I will not be back. I really don't care if I have to sit there and listen to the white men talk. I can make this from the white men talk in 20 minutes. Less than that, honey. And I don't even have to shake ass. And, yeah, no. So, <laughs> we will take today off. And we'll be back on Monday when I go pick up my new license for my new club. So, yeah. Um, yeah. No. No. No, 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 no. So, dancing is good money. It just, it depends on the club that you go to. So, I'm not discouraged. I'm not anything. I'm just... I'm just tried it, like to see what it was. Didn't work at that club. It works for me at the white clubs. And that's where I'm going to go. The white men, I can compete there. I end up probably being the prettiest girl there. I can't compete with no BBL, bitch. Not yet. But, and I feel like my aesthetic is a little weird. Like, it's more for the gays. <laughs> and the white men really fuck with it, but... Nah, y'all, y'all wasn't fucking with me at the urban club. Y'all was not fucking with me. Y'all was not fucking with me. Y'all was not fucking with me. They go there to look for the biggest booty. They don't give a fuck what she looked like. Some of them hoes do not even be putting no baby wipe where you need to go. Oh wait, let's make it. I found another dollar. Let's make it thirty-one. <laughs> Anywho, I'm about to go spend this on breakfast, and um, yeah, I will see you. I'll post the next video, like, of next week. But, yeah. Honestly, first night, second day, this garbage, garbage, garbage. But we're still thankful we made something because we were going to leave with zero dollars. And I was just like, let's just stay. But, yeah. Anywho, girl. I love you. And I will see you in the next one, honey. <laughs> don't be discouraged if you're if you're if you're a dancer and a dancer do not be discouraged girl i'm not gonna get discouraged i'm not mad um i'm not mad and honestly like there was no one to whoop there like the guys don't go for that there like they're just there to see big booty bitches oh sorry they don't care about a face they don't care about an outfit they don't care about hair they just want to see the fattest ass that's it I'm like, damn, bitch, I wasted my time bleaching my asshole. But anywho, I love you. And I love you, and I will see you next time. I'm sorry I didn't do that many money counts. I made a little bit shorter, girl. This was me going back home, and it was just a lie, okay? But I love you, and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Editing the video right now, and I realized I didn't tell you guys how much I made for the three days that I ended up working. I ended up making six eighty, and this is the breakdown of it. So the first day that I was there, I only talked to one guy, and I met this one regular. I talked to one guy, and I pretty much left like around ten o'clock. I got there at like four, and I left at ten. But I only talked to the one guy. Um, pretty much the whole time, I didn't dance or do anything like that. I ended up getting one eighty from him. I ended up tipping thirty, so I believe that gave me like one fifty to take home. And then I went back the next day, and I met him again. And this time, he only gave me forty dollars for like thirty minutes, but he ended up cash me five hundred. So I ended up leaving with four forty, but not really because out of those forty dollars. I still tipped and um I ended up spending like some of it at the bar I got a drink and I ended up spending some money on the girls you know you have to make friends and shit like that so yeah and then at the urban club I made $30 so I ended up the three days with $680 and yeah that's pretty much it um what I'm gonna go for this week is I'm gonna work Thursday Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Saturday and Sunday at my new club. And then um, Friday and uh, Thursday and Friday at the other club that you saw in the vlog. But yeah, I realized I didn't do my money counts and shit like that. Girl, I was stressed this first week. It was very stressful, very chaotic, very crazy, very nerve-wracking. You know, I I'm not trying to be the bitch in the locker room with my phone, but I am, bitch. I'm wearing my tripod now. I feel a little bit more comfortable and things like that. You know, it's all getting Gucci and a coochie. I also did cut the man off that cashed at me the $500 because, uh, like, I'll tell you that in another video, but he was just, 
wanting too much and i'm like yo like no like no 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 so yeah um i love you and yeah i just wanted to tell you about that <laughs>